Errol Ranville has been making music for more than a decade. He has over 19 albums with his group, The Seaweed Band, and is well known for songs such as Run As One, Magic in the Music, and other classic songs. Mr. Ranville was born at St. Rose Le Lac, Manitoba, and now calls Winnipeg his home. He joins us on the line this afternoon. Earl, a pleasure to have you with us. It's wonderful to be chatting with you, Jeremy. Yeah, it's, uh, I'm a big fan of your music uh, for many, many years. I actually had the opportunity to meet you and uh, hear your music when you were up in the Yukon a few years back. You know, your music isn't uh, just plain country. It's uh, pretty much a little bit of everything. Yeah, because, uh, you know, we, we, when Seaweed Band uh, kind of flew to the top of the heap there in, um, in the 80s uh, into the early 90s, we are playing a lot of the commu- like full community events where all ages uh, participated. So our, our sound and our music kind of automatically or naturally went to, uh, or found its own place, so to speak, that so it could satisfy all audiences. And we have Clint William back in the band right now, and uh, so we're playing all the old songs as well. And, uh, you know, with the fiddle, it satisfies a real wide uh, audience. Well, speaking of that, Errol, uh, back in the high school, I don't want to give your age away, back in the 60s, <laughs> under the name of Seaweed and the Weeds. You've since taken out the weeds, and now you're the Aboriginal powerhouse known as the Seaweed Band. You know, after many awards, Juno Awards and all that, what keeps you picking up that guitar every day? You know what, uh, this last album was just absolutely, um, I got a rush of songs. I, like, I wrote um, 12 songs in, in a space of, uh, well, during the healing process after the car accident. And, um, I, you know, um, a year and a half later, I'm getting into a new relationship, and that's where the song, Your Song, comes from. So it's just uh, living, you know, uh, life, and uh, you, you keep on playing your life. <laughs> and what, uh, your song, what is that about? Well, that's just, uh, you know, the girl that I met, and starting a new relationship, starting a new life again at my age, you know, and it's, uh, it's, it's fun. You have to uh, get back living. You can't, um, uh, you know, allowing any kind of uh, uh, depression or... or uh, Staying in a place where it's not pleasant, uh, it doesn't take long for for uh, for you to erode as a as a as a artist. So you know you just got to get back up and and go back to work, and that's what I've, that's what we've done. Earl, you have a new CD out called Forever. It's in stores right now. What can people expect to hear on that? Well, it's uh, it's all my writing. It's all uh, twelve songs that I wrote. One of the songs I co-wrote with uh, my new girlfriend. Um, it's, we, we're getting a lot more sales on iTunes right now than we used to through all the stores and the little mom and pa shops that we had all across Alberta, uh, Yukon, Saskatchewan, um, Ontario. But it seems like now um, a lot of people are buying uh, through iTunes. You know, you're very popular here in Alberta. Are there any chance you coming to Alberta to play a couple uh, concerts? <laughs> Uh, yes, it's been a while. We we uh, almost went to Calgary for um, for a conference that was happening there, but it, it didn't it didn't happen. I was I was dealing while well, because I live in Mexico, usually during the winter. Uh, I have a home there, so I, I bounce back and forth, uh, you know, between November and and April. But uh, we didn't make it then. But what we're looking at now is uh, just booking a series of about six shows across Alberta, just to sort of showcase once again what we're doing right now. And uh, because we got Clint back in the band, it's me and Clint and Don again, the original uh, part of the original lineup of the Seaweed Band. So it's uh, it's it's nostalgic and it's fun for everybody because we're playing the old songs, but we're also playing all the new songs from the new album, which is making it a lot of fun. Well, I'm thoroughly enjoying your new uh, album, especially your song, Quite the Song. Very powerful, and uh, Errol, I appreciate you uh, calling in this afternoon. Thanks, Jeremy, and yeah, it's one.